You may have no DMARC record. You may have no MX records. You may have no DNS records reporting at all. It could be something simple like you haven't renewed your domain name and so your DNS is no longer working. It may be that you don't have name servers set up for your domain name. Name servers are step one of DNS. What do I do if MX Toolbox shows no DMARC or DNS record? That's a problem. If you run a test on your DNS and you have DNS records missing, you may have no DMARC record, you may have no MX records, you may have no DNS records reporting at all. It could be something simple like you haven't renewed your domain name and so your DNS is no longer working. It may be that you don't have name servers set up for your domain name. Name servers are step one of DNS. And name servers basically say, who's hosting my DNS settings? So if you're using a web host, they might be the host of your DNS settings. If you're using a service like Cloudflare to protect your website, they're probably gonna be hosting your DNS settings. So you wanna check your name servers first and see where they're pointing to make sure that you're there, you have them there pointing at something. Now, if you don't have a DMARC record in your MX toolbox or your domain search, well, that could mean that you haven't defined a record and you might need to start from scratch architecting a DMARC record, which is one for your policy. Now, that policy dictates how emails go in and out of your business domain name. And it basically is like a bit of a bouncer standing at the front of a club. It says, who can send emails to this domain? And if the emails don't fit the policy, what do we do with them? Do we just reject them? Do we quarantine them? Do we accept them and let them come through to the business? Now, if you want help setting up your DNS to make sure that it's correct, it is a technical process. So I recommend this only for people who are a bit more confident with tech. You can go to our channel and search for DNS. And we have a number of guides to help business owners get DNS set up, including a long guide on making sure that all of your DNS is set up correctly across the whole business, including DKIM, SPF, and DMARC policies, which are important for every business to make sure that you don't end up in people's spam mailboxes. If you want some help getting this set up, we have a quick fix available on our website, head along to itgenius.com, and we fix DNS settings for business owners every day of the week, especially when they're in an emergency situation and their emails are not working right now. Maybe your emails are going to your customer's spam, or maybe they're not being delivered. Maybe you're not receiving emails. Well, if you click onto a quick fix via our website, you can live chat to our team instantly, start talking to them and get help with the issue that you're facing. If you're based in the US or internationally, it's 197 US dollars. It's only 300 Aussie dollars. And that gets you access to instant support with our team during business hours. They're on chat right now waiting to take your call. So if you'd like some help from them, go ahead and chat to the team and they'll be able to test your domain, see what you've got wrong, give you some pointers if you wanna go ahead and fix it yourself, or you can get our professional team to get it done for you. If you need more help with what we've covered in this video, IT Genius provides support services to businesses all over the world with problems just like this. Click the link below to get started.